fertilizer. A common thing that you find in your household garden shed. But the war in Ukraine has disrupted the shipment of fertilizer from Russia and Belarus. To the point is that a lot of farmers who would plant food in nutrient depleted soil won't get their shipment from Russia or Belarus and from the Ukra uh, Ukraine. Um, Russia has made good sure of that by destroying chemical plants that produce fertilizer. Yeah, and he also made a good thing of um, rocketing any grain uh, elevators in Ukraine, storage of, of grain in Ukraine. And when his forces would go into a village, they made sure to destroy the tractors. They basically put either thermite or blew them up, okay? That prevents the Ukraine farmers from farming. Uh, sweet President Putin, isn't he? But the big thing is, is uh, potassium, uh, which is mined in Russia. Um, phosphorus, or which is mined in Russia, and nitrogen, fertilizer, which is created in that and sold cheaply to third world nations. That's until Putin started his war. He's not shipping anything out of there, and nobody's going to is willing to accept anything he does ship out of there. Um, not that, you know, they basically, you know, he, he started a war. But it's, it is bad. It's really bad. Uh, the United States would, was one of those importers of, of specified fertilizer. Phosphoric, phosphorus uh, uh, rock from per, uh, Peru. Uh, of course, you've got your bad back droppings. You've got other uh, thing. Uh, we basically make our own nitrogen. Um, we use ammonia. It's broken chemically down to to nitrogen. Um, somebody has a process of taking nitrogen out of the air. Okay. Mixing it with uh, couple of chemicals and making a diluted nitric acid which can be used on a flame. It is, you know, nitric acid, very diluted. And you, can, you, can, you can stick your finger into it and you're not going to burn your finger. Uh, and apply that as a, a nitrogen fertilizer. It's not practical. Oh yeah, well it's experimental. Uh, will you commercialize it? No. Because it's Oh, it's cheap, considering, but you need to have a selected process. It's like taking nitrogen from ammonia, you know, the little ammonia. Um, there is a waste to that, which is when you're, make, you're making ammonia, you are also producing CO2 which is bad. Now they got something called blue am ammonium and green ammonium which basically that way is they're taking uh, CO2 that's being produced and shoving it into the earth. I mean deeply shoving it into the earth. Or take put it in storage trucks and uh, find another well site and shove it down in, into the earth, you know, 20,000 feet down. Hopefully it will stay, it, it, it will migrate slowly up or stay down there, combining with the rocks. What's that, calcium carbide? Um, 
or as they say, to the cola industry. Yeah. But again, they, you know, um, some of these third world countries don't have, they don't have a way to produce their own fertilizer outside of a nice soil or from their cattle. Uh, many of them do not have wastewater treatment plants to pull uh, minerals from that. Hey, you know, they are, their population expanded beyond the point of, of taking care of it. What, what can be done? They're trying different methods, and most of the methods are not commercialized. They're experimental. And uh, what are you going to do? Um, some of these methods are toxin to the environment. They release CO2. Yeah, well, hey, you have to feed the population you have. Too bad you can't find a way to get, get rid of it. Well, in the United States, we did a population control the last two years. Um, 400,000 died of COVID-19 before the vaccine, and 600,000 died after the vaccine came out. They refused to be vaccinated. Oh, well, that's a million people you don't have to feed, except for the million that's happened to be on the border right now. Oh, yes, we want to come in. Do you have a job? No, but you're going to give me money, give me housing, give me clothing, give me food, or I will riot. Yeah. I'm a dirt farmer, and I'm going to farm land. There's no, no land to farm. It's all taken care of. Oh, no, you can't do that. You have to give me land. And if you disagree, you're a racist. But, again, we go, we go back to the, the fertilizer. We, it is a really expensive process if you're set up to do it that's nothing but they said uh, some of these countries do not have the processing equipment you know ammonia nitrate goes into these these countries if they don't use it to blow up something but ammonia nitrate goes in there and has yeah, ammonia nitrate pure ammonia nitrate and then they, of course they add it, add it to the water uh, they also have ammonia nitrate pe pellets that go in there. But again, you, s you have to have a, a source for everything. And um, nitrogen, uh, raw nitrogen, you know, basically doubles every month. <laughs> it's like, well, February was this price, yeah. April was this price, March is this price, right. June, July, August. That's that's the growing season. Um, and it will stay high. Farmers won't be able to afford it. Countries won't be able to afford it. And they say, well, why don't you build a plant? Easier said than done. <sighs> so, as long as Putin has war going on, uh, the world's in, in Christ crisis. And his, his, one of his theories is he's going to steal all the grain from the Ukraine and sell it on the world market. Let the Ukrainians starve. Yeah, well, hey, that's, that's what he wants to do is kill all the Ukrainians. And uh, I guess anybody else doesn't make any difference. It's, it basically risks somewhere like 400 million people risk of starvation in the coming year. Oh, America has grain. America only has so much green they're going to sell to the United Nations. And I can guarantee you one thing. I'm not starving. I'm going to get my bread. Now, if he gets too much, if you go, they're going to have, you don't want, you have riots in this country. You don't, you don't want food riots. Uh, that, that looks bad. But... 
again, American farmers are stuck. They need, uh, they will simply revert back to the old methods of stuff, even though it produces a lot of byproduct called CO2. Uh, they need nitrogen and um, byproducts of CO2. So, that, that is a problem.